My name is Susan Olenek. I'm a senior user experience designer here at Undead Labs, and I was strike team lead for character customization in State of Decay 2. Paper prototyping is taking an idea, putting it down on paper, and testing it to make sure it works before we expend the art and engineering resources to get a feature up and running. And also, it got everyone on board and really excited to build this because there's nothing like playing a paper board game version of your video game. We had concerns about the discoverability of this feature because the closet lives deep in the community screen. Through paper prototyping, I was able to get a gut check with everyone on board at the studio if they feel that all the systems we had planned will direct users into the closet. What really excites me about this update is not only are we adding a really fun feature to this game, but we're giving our studio an opportunity to drop content on a regular basis in a new way. We already have the weapon trader, and now we're going to be able to drop some clothing and hats on a regular basis. And this is going to be so much fun for everybody involved, for our fans and for the developers. The reason why we wanted to get this feature done was because we needed to ship in early October. Why would that be? Well, you'll have to stay tuned to find out at the end of the month. <laughs>